Had a long day. It started at 5.30 this morning, and it's... Yo, uh, I swear, I did not leave this apartment without there being hand soap in the bathroom. Was there no hand soap in the bathroom? Hi, Allison and Hannah here. The Arnsman sisters. This is our first vlog. We don't know what we're doing. Um, Obviously. <laughs> we're surrounded by nature. We love nature. We want to make sure that that's known in our, in our vlogs. <laughs> we're not doing very well so far. <laughs> Hello, is this thing on? <laughs> so we were supposed to post this a week ago. Mm -hmm. And uh, we got back, basically, or long story short, we haven't had internet all week. And that kind of makes um, uploading and editing and blah, blah, blah. Fun times. So are you going to talk about why we're doing a vlog? Yeah. We decided since a lot of what we do in training and just everyday life, a lot of people don't see it. All they see is your name on a result sheet or maybe you at a race. So we're like, well... What would it look like to bring people along on the journey as we train and go through life and just be a little more real that way? So we just realized that we didn't record a transition video for after Hannah's talking about why we're doing the vlog and everything. And we wanted to put together a short segment of different things we did over the summer. Now, I was out training in the West in, oh, I'm so sorry, that was the fourth year, not the third year. And then Hannah was in her internship in Murphy, North Carolina, far west North Carolina. So yeah, so here's, I guess that, I don't know, a montage, a mon montage? Montage. with music, and mucus, epic music, mucus. mucus. All right, we gotta close this door. Sadly. We... Not again. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Hannah. features one is that maybe two videos from I think they were test videos downloaded and the rest just deleted so we lost all of our GoPro footage from, from GoCross from GoCross and we were like it'd be really cool to recreate GoCross because it would kind of be like this and this and really bumpy or and <laughs> that <laughs> and uh, and bugs and watch actually look nice for once in future, okay. wait, where's some dust? Because there's a lot of dust. Oh, don't worry, I got you. I'm gonna get hit with dust in a second here. Oh dear. I'm terrified right now. Are you gonna throw that on my head, or are you just gonna throw that around the camera? And... Oh no, don't. The special effects are so good on this vlog. Second to none. <laughs> that was Go Cross. So, so here we are. Last season, uh, basically a lot of stuff, life decisions that I made snowballed into my body just shutting down with chronic fatigue. And 
took the whole season off, which was hard for me. So I spent the summer doing some Xterra to build back up the fitness and the, the what am I trying to say? The engine? Words are hard. I, I had fun with that. I won one of them. Um, I died on the, all the other three. So impressive. Qualified for Worlds. Fun fact. I don't think that was a very hard thing to do. Why? I'm not going. It's in the middle of cross season. You can't do that. I'm so late. And <laughs> slap you with this piece of grass. So I'm coming into my season with no points, no UCI points, not not really ranked at all. I'm having fun with that because I get the random draw, which I haven't had that since I was 17. Random draw is where you get kind of drawn out of a hat for where your start grid position is. So. Uh, last weekend in Roanoke, I was second to last the first day, and then I got third row start the second day, so it's just really, li literally a randomized draw. It's good. I'm back to feeling strong, and um, I'm excited for the season. I'm just taking it one race at a time and doing the best I can. I would love to say my goal is world championships, but because I'm coming into the season with absolutely zero points and the start is everything, I don't know. I don't know what the season's gonna hold in that regard. That's my, that's my ish. I believe in you. Oh, that's funny. I believe in you, even if you have a blue dot or something. So last season, I also kind of had like a more chill season as far as racing was concerned because uh, there was a class I was taking that went all fall, and part of that uh, semester, you plan a 21-day expedition and you go on it. So I was literally off the bike for 21 days in the woods somewhere with an 80 pound backpack, you know, hiking around. Excited to come into this year, being able to fully commit my time to training. And Hannah's top three U23 use, like UCI rank in our nation right now, which means that she will be racing in the World Cup in Iowa City this coming weekend and uh, she's got a lot of opportunities for Worlds qualifiers. Uh, Worlds is in Switzerland this year, which will be super cool. So that's that's kind of what you're aiming for. Yeah, I'm, I'm stoked. I'm gonna gonna well, try for it. Stoked. Gonna try for it, yeah, gonna do it. I'm stoked. <laughs> I'm stoked for you. Stoked to be amped, amped to be stoked. Bonjour stupid. Bonjour stupid. <laughs>